Hello there, this is the lighter side of Black Bright and um, yeah I'm going to be talking about Love Island for those of you who um, like Love Island and the reason why I'm going to do it this way is because I forget that I have people watching from abroad so when I'm talking about Love Island and I'm talking about Luke T and Shanice I had someone say so why don't you let us see videos of it and I'm like I wonder if that's copyright but I don't think it is because it's already gone and so what I decided to do was to show you two clips of why I think Shanice and Luke T should win Love Island. I mean, I think it's the most romantic uh, moment ever. So I'm going to show you that because um, last night there wasn't much happening. Well, when I say there wasn't much happening, they had meet the parents. So it all, you know, when they're having couples, they don't know what they're parents are thinking or feeling so when they choose a partner they really want their parents validation and their parents blessing so when they're with somebody they don't kind of feel really into them because at the back of their minds they're thinking I wonder if my mum would like them or I wonder if my dad would like them I know technically you shouldn't really care about what other people think or what your, whether or not your parents approve of your partner, but most of us want our parents' blessings. So, therefore, it was very important for everyone in the villa to meet the other side's parents and to, so they could gauge how they felt about each other. I was quite surprised that um, Jess's um, parents were so open to Ched. I mean, they... they they thought he was wonderful so that was good so there were actually there was no opposition with none of the families the only thing I could think of is that there was one where the parents didn't come and they sent um, a family member but since the um, islander didn't mind I assume it was fine so yeah it was it went really well and now we have the final four so as of next week, there'll be no one coming in. We've got the four contestants and we'll, out of the four, one couple will win. So we've got Jess and Ched. I'm going to put their pictures up in the, um, what do you call it, on the cover. So we've got Jess and Ched. We've got Demi and Luke. T, Luke M. We've got Luke T and Shanice and we have Finn and Paige. So now let me tell you why I think Luke T and Shanice will win or should win based on this video that I took from my television. <laughs> Like you are my fairy tale. From like a week ago, 
weekend if you left, I think I would have had to leave just because we were so close straight away, just always laughing, always so easy, we both care for each other so much, we just feel so genuine and I just appreciate you so much, it's crazy. I let you get cry. It's just because you just make me you make me cry happy. Yeah. You know? That's true. Okay, that's the first part, and I'm just gonna show you the short second part which seals it. Seals the winning. The win, I think. So in five years, where do you see yourself or where do you see us? We're being married. Yeah. <laughs> Having four, four beautiful kids. babies. Yeah. Couple like one by one. Like one by one. That's a load of break, by the way. That's like nine months next, nine months next. But it's worth it. Yeah. <laughs> I just feel like we just got really lucky to meet each other. I think everybody, every woman wishes for that fairy tale, don't they? So, yeah, so that is the reason why I think Luke T and Shanice should win the Love Island prize of 50000 Um, If you agree, based on that little video, please tell me. Um, I did have some other clips, but I don't know. I think it might be a bit overkill if I try to show them. I wanted to show you the one where they were looking after a baby they had a baby challenge and they were all looking after they were dolls but they didn't get the doll the dolls wouldn't stop crying so they was getting all agitated about it but if i can just show you a quick one of the baby challenge that you might find that amusing that's if i can find it okay this one <laughs> I don't get in there very ready for that. You know, I want it when I'm like 30 or something. Yeah, okay. Yeah, when you have baby, you just kind of. What's happened? Oh, is that it? Oh, sorry about that. That's not the one I wanted to show you then, is it? I wanted to show you the baby challenge, but. Not to worry. That's what happens when you try to extend something just for the sake of it. So I shall leave it there. And that's all for now. Bye-bye.